Hearing the news that they're eligible to get the COVID-19 vaccine, many teachers in Texas are eagerly signing up. Teachers in the Brazos Valley say this is a long time coming, but what a relief it is. Jennifer Hendricks loves teaching science. She says it's one of those subjects that incorporates a lot of hands on learning, which at the sixth grade level is pretty important. It's so much fun watching kids make connections with science. This past year has been a range of emotions for teachers. When Hendricks got word that Harmony Science Academy and Brian would return to some in person learning around the beginning of the school year, she had her concerns. Just the fear of coming around people because I had been pretty much a hermit for four months at this point. Other teachers also shared those same worries, especially when it came to the safety of their students and fellow staff members regarding COVID-19. The first concern was for whether or not I would potentially catch it and spread it to somebody who would be immunocompromised. Some hope came in December when the FDA approved the emergency use of two COVID-19 vaccines. But as the weeks went on, those who work in schools were left off of lists of the groups to receive the vaccine. You think about these people who go out there and serve their community in such a way, and you hear of teachers not being on that list. There seems to be a bit of a disconnect there. Those frustrations turned into sighs of relief Wednesday. The Texas Department of State Health Services expanded the list of people eligible for the COVID-19 vaccine to include teachers and child care providers. A huge relief. I was able to sign up this morning for an appointment to receive my first dose of the vaccine tomorrow afternoon. For Hendricks, it's like a weight off her shoulders to be able to get vaccinated. That I will be able to sleep a little easier. She can focus on teaching instead of worrying if today is the day she will catch COVID. Because I will be protected and I will be protecting not just myself, my fiance, but also my students. The DSHS says teachers being vaccinated does not change other groups being prioritized for vaccinations in Texas.